Guys, welcome back to Black Spruce Country. You see this old, uh, I don't know what you call it, structure? I got a project. Uh, I wanted to go to my cabin. I had a couple of projects to do down there again, but uh, my wife mentioned uh, this would be a great she shed. She shed. But anyway, so this is my project next. I got to turn this structure into a she shed. So, now let me. All right, guys, let's show you the structure. I actually started this last summer. And they're pallets, the simple packing pallets that come on transport trucks. And uh, let's have a quick look here. Lots of frogs still around. So it's not very big. I gotta, but it's big enough for her. That's all she wanted. It's gonna be a, I got a patio doors to go on this side, and a couple little windows in the side. And so the base was already here. The previous owners had the uh, something else on. I don't know what it was, but uh, so I guess the first project we're going to do. Well, we got to cut the alders away. So I'm going to build a. Uh, out four foot deck coming out here coming down with stairs so utilize the uh, patio doors to get in it so and this is going to be her view once I we cut all this out this will be her view right here beautiful so let's get started mama's going to help me with this one so hopefully it's going to be well, it's going to take a while to do it, so there's going to be a series of videos. So, I'll label them video number one today. Let's we'll see how far we'll get. And we hope you enjoy it. It should be a neat little project. Mama showed up. Are we ready to start? All materials are on hand. And on this project, company name All Powers. Another review. So they sent me this unit. I'm going to try it. It's a bigger unit. Uh, I'm going to. It's an 1800 watt, this one. You can see it down here or not. But 1800 watt but I'll do a review after I'm going to use it for a while first as usual and this one got the uh, cell phone ports as well you got to push the DC button okay. so there's a DC button down here and is it on that's the cell phone charger port is it working no, I get the magnetic thing that I can you affect it We'll play with that after. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Whew. 
four posts. They heavy. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Hey guys, good morning. It's uh, day two for our project. As you can see, we got our decking done. Well, almost done, just about. I want to get the board put on that now, so I spent a couple days ago sawing deck lumber on my sawmill. Right here, we'll get that going. So we're still going to use this all power power station today. Uh, 1800 watt so we'll do a little review on it after I just want to use it a little bit more see how I think what I think about it and I downloaded the uh, app for today for my cell phone and really you got to use the app to operate the, uh, the unit actually and which I'm not really keen on but uh, anyway I got it done so we're just going to saw off some lumber now and get it screwed onto the decking and then we'll do the stairs and after that we'll start the uh, construction of the uh, little she shed itself yeah don't laugh all right feature for this uh, all power station guys uh, they sent me a solar panel as well and I figured it'd be sunny like this today we're getting a little low on our charge so I'm gonna hook up this here solar panel but check this thing out you guys have been using the, uh, the all powers now for a bit and uh, battery was depleted a little bit so I hooked up the solar panel that came with it just a folding solar panel and it's got these little convenient stands on it cable and this cable came with it provided and just this cable was attached to the solar panel but this is the one that came with it just plug in here and 
it goes into the side of the unit right here. Like I said, I'm going to explain uh, later. Uh, it's too bright out here. It's a little bit hot too, so I'm going to take it inside soon and just give you, show you the features of this unit. But this just plugs in right here on the side. This is a solar panel charge in, plug in them in. There's a circuit breaker here, reset, and here's your wall charger where your cable goes in to uh, charge it to your 110 volt household wall unit. But uh, it was down at 70%. Uh, I had this hooked up for about 45 minutes. I don't know if we can see it, but it's up at 100% already. The sun is so powerful. So it definitely works well, this uh, solar panel. I guess the more powerful the sun, the faster it charges. So let's get back at the uh, project. I gotta make some, uh, this is really hot here and uh, I just wanna get the stairs done right here, a couple of steps and then we'll call it quits. But uh, that's all I can take today. It's extremely hot here. I just wanted to finish that part, so not too bad so far. Now that pond, I'm gonna go jump in it. Try to cool down my body. Then we'll go inside and I'll do a point out the features of this uh, all powers unit there. Give you some. Uh, Pictures of it, I'll tell you what I think of it. the next morning from yesterday when I was doing my uh, little she shed down by the uh, pond there and I got so overcome with heat 
And when I did my little video, I jumped right to the lake. Well, we have a creek over on the property, it looks seven foot deep. I jump right into that and uh, try to cool my body down. But anyway, I said I'm done with this today. But this morning, I get a couple uh, views on these uh, all power units. As you can see, there's two. Now, I used this one for my project yesterday, and it worked out good. The uh, the uh, 1500 model, R1500, which is the 1500-1800 watt. This is the 600-600 uh, watt. And, you know, it can't run a power saw or anything like that, but it can run a, uh, a uh, laptop, toaster, coffee maker, you know, small appliances. This year it can run, like, big appliances, refrigerator, actually for seven hours. It can run toaster, any, any appliance inside, uh, you know great rig for a power failure um, five-year warranty with both of them uh, what comes with the package uh, let me see here they got these warranty card the manual and uh, and a power cord for each one that's that one and this is this one so that's what come with the package and first of all, let me talk about the, uh, you've seen the, uh, the solar panel. So this is what it folds up like. A neat little carrying package. And all your cables, hey, come on, they go in this little pouch. So here's your cable. And it comes with a variety of different cables for different uh, units so which is a good great little feature as well so anyway uh, let's talk about the uh, unit I'll talk about the big one well, I'll talk about both of them actually uh, this one here both on Amazon eight nine hundred dollars three hundred dollars I think that's the price they're going for yeah, but next week, Amazon Prime Days, uh, All Powers wanted me to mention that uh, July 16th and 17th, Prime Days. So these units will be on sale. So check it out next week, July 16th and 17th on Amazon Prime Days. And the link will be in the description below. Uh, my channel, Black Spruce Country. So if you went uh, Black Spruce Country, B s c 10 that's your code for a 10 percent discount and the link description will be in the uh, right up below now guys i'm going to point out some uh, features of these units uh, let's do the big one first let's just turn the power on right here and on the video yesterday I had her charged into the solar power because I was down to 70 percent and now we're up at 99 percent and uh, some features here so right away you can see uh, we got a DC 12 volt cigarette lighter and uh, on the this side I showed you that yesterday but uh, you got your charge unit for your, your 110 volt wall socket, your circuit breaker over protection, and your solar power plug in. Part. And on the other side, so if you want an expansion battery ports, there's two here. If you want to plug in another unit and get more power, you see one, two, number one, two, extension power. So uh, that's great too if you want to add uh, another unit. And uh, so we got your 110 volt, we got uh, AC power, we got four 110. Don't mind the noise in the background. I got two roosters here, and it seems like when I talk, they get louder, so apologize for that. Four 110 plug ins, and to operate that, you just push your, oh, don't turn it off, your AC, and your AC icon comes up here. It might be hard to see you now with the sunlight. And like I say, uh, if you want to operate any 110 volt piece of equipment tool or toaster or coffee maker plug it in here you can use four of them at one time and make sure you push the AC icon right and we also have DC 
do you see up here the icon comes up here and we have two USA 18 watt max 18 watt max and uh, we got uh, two USC 100 watt max right here and the good thing about this too there's a couple of uh, cell phone charging ports on top but you got to have your DC turn on keep quiet Chuck see you hear that one and there's two up there one two and this one over here I'll do the same thing here and turn the power on for this one and turn your DC on there you go that one works as well now let me just flick over this one real quick this one's got the 110 volt as well or sorry 12 volt cigarette lighter two 110 ports AC DC same thing this one here actually has a light an LED light and on the side of this one it's the same thing really cable circuit breaker solar power hookup so this in here will be used I think my wife is gonna gonna take this one and use it down in her she shed because all she's gonna use is her laptop her lights maybe uh, well she uses music from her cell phone but uh, she's not gonna use much so I think she's uh, she's gonna claim this one now getting back to this thing here uh, yeah, that's a bit off with the features. It's, it's pretty, pretty good. It weighs uh, 38, 37 pounds, actually. So easy to carry and handles on the side. I'm not going to get into the nitty gritty of the uh, internal contents, but it is a, uh, what's, there's a life PO4 batteries in these internal uh, workings of these units. And these batteries will last for about 10 years with 3,500 cycles. So if you're turning it off and on 3,500 times, are you gonna use it that much? No, I doubt very much. And the good thing about this one too, she's got a UPS uh, function. What that is, it's a uninterrupted power supply. So you guys in the States may have that issue, but we don't get a whole lot of power failures up here in Canada. But if you have this plugged in, say if you're expecting a, a storm, and you want to, didn't want to lose the power in your refrigerator or freezer plug it in and if the power does go within 10 milliseconds this here is going to take over and power your 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 unit up right away so and like i said seven hours hopefully you'll have power back by then so anyway that's the good thing about that one so what else can we say about this unit? Oh yeah, we got a UP, we got the uh, app on this one. So, all power is an app. And you can see that right here. Push on it. I got my device. And I got to put the device in there. So I got to turn my... Okay, we got the Bluetooth device on. You had to push your DC and push it again and hold it for a few seconds. And what'll come up is uh, your device, add your device, and you push on it. And what's coming up here, like I say, hopefully we can see this, 99% add, 99% left. And I got my DC power on here. DC, you turn it off, turn it on. Let's turn it off. AC. AC is on. AC is on. And we go up here in the corner. Now this thing here, it's got um, three modes. You've got a standard mode, fast mode, and a mute, mute, mute mode. So mute mode is uh, it's in here standard right now. So in standard mode, it's good for charging. It takes about uh, three hours for fully charge. And mute mode, if you push mute mode up here, because there is some sound with this, so uh, it'll quiet in the machine. And you can charge it in mute mode as well. And, um, you know, but really, there's only a little bit of noise. So it really don't affect. It doesn't bother me. You got a fast mode here as well. 
and you can charge it in fast mode too why uh, you'd want to I guess if you're working on a project and you need tools real quick and it takes about an hour at 115 volt watt per hour but I will keep it on uh, standard mode and in standard mode like I said it takes about three hours to fully charge it and I can hear the little noise here now the machine you probably won't hear it but uh, but that's the good thing about this you got to download the app to operate these uh, three modes that's one thing I don't like about it I would prefer if it had a, uh, a button on here to operate your three modes instead of having you using your cell phone because I don't take this everywhere with me I prefer not to have it but I guess you got to have your app downloaded to uh, in order to operate the uh, three modes so this is the all powers app pretty simple setup and uh, I guess most people carry their phones with them these days but uh, that's the one downfall I have with this unit now what else do we talk about I think that's about it for uh, for uh, these two units this one here will be going camping with us next week and I'm going to do another little review on this one but for now I just wanted to get it out there to get it ready for your prime days next week with Amazon so like I said guys check it out on Amazon Prime and uh, next week July 16th 17th and uh, I hope you like my backdrop by the way I got the horses there they're happy they got brand new hay fresh hay cut last week so we got some happy girls out there and uh it's going to be a hot day again today, another 30 degrees Celsius, so it's back to the beach for us today. Anyway, it's going to be a series of videos with the shed build. Let me show you the shed down the back here, where the location of it. Way down the corner, you can see it down there. And uh, that's where it is. All the trees will be cleared out. It's going to be too hot to work on it today, but I would say, I don't know how many videos, there's going to be at least six, seven, eight videos on that to get that fully completed, so. Enjoy the videos, and again, thanks for tagging along with us today, and uh, like, subscribe, take care, God bless.